welcome and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I want to share some videos with you that I found or had referred to me by viewers that have some interesting information that you may not have heard yet about the case of missing Orson and Orrin West from California City, California. In a previous video, I told you about the YouTube channel called Chris Thorne's Show when he spoke with the previous owner of the home that the West boys adoptive parents currently own the home where the boys supposedly went missing. The creator of that channel has been all over this case, and he's had more interesting guests on his channel, so I want to let you know about them and where you can hear what they have to say. The first video I want to tell you about on Chris Thorne's show is called Update Grandparents Uncle's Extended Family Issues Statement. Now aside from the obvious from his video title, Chris interviews a creator that I've recommended to you before called Crenshaw Incorporated. Crenshaw has also been all over this case. She lived in Bakersfield, California, and she knows of the biological mother of the boys, and she knows some of her family members. So, she's getting first-hand true information from the bio family itself. She discusses the reason behind Orson and Orin, or Sincere and Classics, removal from their bio mom's care, and other important details about the case. She is well informed and very invested in this case. So her interview is worth a watch. It starts at the 56 minute mark in case you want to go right to it. She also has a video on her channel, Crenshaw Incorporated, that is a recording of her trying to obtain information about the 911 call that was placed by the Wests on the evening of December 21st of 2020. Her video is called, I contacted Kern County trying to request the 911 call for the California City Missing Boys. You can find that video on her channel, again, called Crenshaw Incorporated. The second video I want to tell you about on Chris Thorne's show is an interview he did with YouTuber Analyzing Life. This one is also an interesting one. Apparently, YouTube creator Analyzing Life has been in contact with the boy's biological grandfather. I believe she said he is their mother's father, and she reads a statement that the bio-grandfather made after the extended family made their formal statement. Now, I'm not going to steal her thunder, but she did share some good information from him about a previous family he claims had Orson and Orrin West before the Wests got them and how the boys' bio family didn't even know they were being adopted by the Wests until the end stage of the adoption process. He also has a woman on who explains the process through which the boys would have been placed outside of the bio family. It's some really good information. That video on Chris Thorne's channel is called Chris Thorne's Live with YouTuber Analyzing Life. The channel, Analyzing Life, also has a number of interesting videos about the case as well. The last video I want to share with you was sent to me by my buddy Jen. Thanks, Jen! And it's from the YouTube channel, Nor Jasmine. I hope I pronounced that right. It's spelled N-O-O-R space Jasmine. Her video is called, I went to Orin and Orson West's house to ask around. Now, she doesn't get to interview the West's neighbors on camera, but she does go to the house, and she does speak with one man. She said none of the neighbors she spoke with said they ever saw the boys at that house. So, that one is worth a watch as well. If you check out these videos, please consider liking them and subscribing to their channels to support the work they're putting into this case. And that's all I have for now. But I will keep searching for information popping up on the internet so I can share it with you. And I ask that you share any information you feel is credible that you're finding with me. That way we can all keep sharing what we're finding out and we can all stay informed. I know we all want to see precious Orson and Orrin come home safe. While we're waiting, I'll be praying for them. Thank you all so very much for watching. Stay safe out there, 
and I'll see you on my next video.